All right, this is Mr. Mark Monarsic. He is a left above the knee amputee, and he is in the office today for a height adjustment. We're gonna watch this real close. Um, this is a silicone roll-up liner, so basically what we're gonna do is the patient has this cut down to a particular size, and it's shorter in the growing area than it is on the outside, so when he goes to put it on, He's gonna roll it up with this to the inside, this to the outside. So he's got the landing cord on the bottom. Um, after you've worn it for a little bit, it gets a lot easier to put on and take off. You wanna make sure you don't get any wrinkles in it at all. If you get any wrinkles in it, then wherever the wrinkle is, it will cause a blister on your residual limb. And we want the A, always, he always makes sure that the A is in the front somewhere, that way the lanyard strap is on the side so the lanyard strap is going to come out of the side of the socket and attach here so this is what holds the prosthetic onto his limb. 95% of all amputees wear some kind of silicone liner now and over the silicone liner sometimes as the residual limb starts to shrink um, the longer you wear prosthetic you're confined in this prosthetic socket so your residual limb is going to shrink and as it starts to shrink then what's gonna happen is we're gonna create room inside of the socket, so it's gonna be like buying a shoe that's too big. So the way that we take up the room inside of the socket is, we call it sock management. We use these different plies of sock. The socks take up the space so that we don't get the rubbing in the wrong places, okay? Once we get moving around inside of the socket too much, then we've gotta add socks. And you know how that feels, it'll start going up and down, start feeling a lot of pressure in, in the adductor area, um, feeling a lot of pressure in your rear end, and right on the bottom of the bone. And the lanyard goes right through the bottom of the sock. And he's going to pull the sock up all the way he's up. And we have no wrinkles in it. And then what he's going to do is take your lanyard strap. There's a drop it down through the bottom of the socket. There's a exit hole here. So the strap will come out here. And he pulls himself into the socket. Comes up through the loop. Back down onto itself. And that locks him into the socket. So he wants to make sure when he, when he stands up, he puts all his weight on the prosthetic and settles down into the socket really nice with the sock on, and then he pulls himself in there nice and tight. So that he's all the way at the distal end, and so the ischium back in the back, the ischial seat, he's sitting in the ischial seat of the socket. <laughs> 